I haven't done a video of me talking about my progress of playing Hollow Knight. Basically, I did set my goal of 112%ing this game. Basically, platinuming Hollow Knight until So Song comes out, which we still don't know yet. And the reason why it's been weeks since I played this game because I was stuck on Pantheon of the Night, aka Pantheon 4. But then after weeks of me not playing it, I finally got past that. I do want to fight Zod before I ascend the Pantheon of Hollow Ness, although one of my subscribers did say I don't get rewarded after after fighting Zoe, only thing that happens is the fat ladybug sitting right next to me on the bench. And so, without further ado, I also wanted to remind you guys that I beat it Pantheon 1 and Pantheon 2 when I did my comeback to Hollow Knight on Season 2. Pantheon 3. Jesus Christ, man. The amount of times it took me to get through that and unlocked a new mode called Godseeker, I still find it hard to believe that I managed to get passed through that. And here it is. Pantheon of the Night. And I freaking did it. Look at it. I know you see it. Also, when I go to this place called Hall of the Gods, there's these two gates that open when I beat the final Pantheon or Pantheon of Hollow Nest or Pantheon 5. And I did see a little spoiler by a YouTuber going by the name of Vixie that was doing Pantheon with all the bindings. Only thing I saw was her fighting the Absolute Radiance and she died on that part. And then she says, are you serious? And she's so calm about it. Like, I just feel destroyed that she's so nonchalant, so chill about it. And I'm over here struggling for my freaking life oh yeah and i figured that after you do pantheons one through four the coins are gonna be on top of this thing i also want to say that on the bottom over there it looks like a bird you have to go to the left and wall jump to the top you end up going here and then once you keep walking forward there's a big sauna where you can refuel your soul and once you look up that's where you have to wall jump once you start wall jumping you hear this I can't fathom how much effort I put into this and I've reached this far and I've gone to the final level. I'm aware that there's going to be 40 bosses including the version 2 of Radiance aka the Absolute Radiance. I've seen the spoilers. But like I said, I didn't really think I'll get to Pantheon of the Night and then ascend to Pantheon of Hall Nest. The amount of time it took me to get there after taking a long break and just like seeing this to myself that I've gone this far. I didn't think that would make it this far using my blood blood sweat and tears fighting tooth and nail to get passed through pantheon of the night and now ascending to pantheon of hollow nest i even doubted myself and i don't really think positive or get like some random motivation like during the streams because i'm i'm more of a person that thinks realistic because that's just the way i think after playing you know like a bunch of hard games or hard levels but i still can't believe that i made it this far and i also want to thank you guys for watching me do this and struggling to get past but yeah i just wanted to make a short video to talk about my hollow knight progress i know a lot not a lot of people are watching this but i just wanted to make a video about it that's gonna be it hollow knight season three is coming soon and that's all i'm gonna say this is wolf.gray and i'll see you all later until hollow knight season three